Welcome to the channel, Skins for Life, or even the hat, please burgundy and gold. Now I'm going to just bring to you a uh, three minute clip of Mike Golick tearing down Madden 12. Now you're going to hear from start to finish, so you'll hear the good of what Madden is trying to do, and of course Mike Golick's view of that change in the game. So here you go. Okay, y'all gotta check this out. Tell me if this guy's on point or not. Game that Golik and all the other rough, tough football players are gonna be afraid of. Madden NFL 12 is going to, of course, the insanely popular oh, yeah. uh, NFL video game. Which the vote this year for who was gonna go on the cover of that whole deal, so I, it's unbelievably popular. I believe yeah. that's still going on. Mm -hmm. The game's uh, executive producer is a guy named Phil Frazier. Uh huh who told uh, the New York Times that Madden NFL 12 has the new concussion rule and has taken helmet-to-helmet -helmet hits and head-first tackling out of the game. They have shown how this can be a teaching tool to players of the game, and they have added a new thing, a new element to their game, where if a player suffers a concussion, they will take him out of the game for the remainder of the game. In the video game now we're talking about, they will make him sit out, right. and there will be an explanation like Gus Johnson and Chris Collinsworth, who voiced the game, right. of how in the uh, in this era concussions have to be taken so seriously they're very dangerous, and so the player cannot come back into the game. And they are using helmet to helmet hits and all that kind of stuff as a teaching tool on the video. That is so stupid. Tell me why it's stupid. Why? Well, what, what, what? Because it's not real. It's a video <laughs> game. Okay. Okay. Let them destroy one another on the video game. If let me tell you, if a player has has a problem distinguishing between the video game he's playing and then going on the field and doing it, he shouldn't be in the league anyway, okay? This is ridiculous. You want to talk about the, the, the height of overthinking something? Yes, let's let them play Madden 12. They'll all learn a wonderful lesson from this. You can't go helmet to helmet, even in a video game. We'll teach those guys. How dumb is that? It's actually not dumb. It's so stupid. Let me ask you a question. Yeah. How are most young people today learning the game of football by watching it yeah, by what and, and by, i tell you right now oh, there are more kids playing stop. this game Do you than know how many, football. let me tell you what if kids parlayed what they saw in video games and in the real world they'd all be in jail stop it well that's just, a bad just please stop it you know what so what you're saying is, because in other areas we are doing stupid things by teaching kids these incredibly violent lessons and these incredibly oh, yeah, violent video yeah. games. Oh yeah, these kids are going to learn. Listen, if we can't clean up the NFL, at least we can clean up the Madden. Dad, game. look what I learned today. I'm in favor of it. Catch Mike and Mike every weekday from 6 to 10 a.m. Eastern on ESPN Radio and on ESPN2. As you saw right there, Mike Golick pretty much own Madden in that video so I don't have to say anything else Mike Gillick that's why you're an all pro football 2k on my Eagles team Peace. Did I say my Eagles team? Am I stupid? I'm a Redskins fan. God, what's wrong with See, the, the beauty of live filming. Peace.